Hello friends, welcome again and this is my new project music management system. You can say it music library management system, online music portal. Right, so these will be the three uh, different titles of this project music management system. And I have developed this project in PHP and MySQL. The version for the PHP, I'm using the PHP version 7 and MySQL version is 5.6. I'm running this project on the Jam server, but you can also run this project on the BAM server or your Linux machine or the Mac server, right? Mac machine, right? So these all the server side technologies and operating systems which you, on which you can run this project. Right. For front-end development, I have used the HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Some of the jQuery library also have used like form validations, date calendar plugin integrations, and many more things I have used the jQuery plugins, right? So let's start with the functionality go through. So the project title is Music Management System and it's a PHP and MySQL web-based major DBMS project. Major because it has admin login as well as customer registration and login, right? The main objective to develop uh, this project is to manage the music and user can listen music online, right? So this is the main objective for developing this project, right? So let's start with the functionality go through. So this is the home page of the project. You can see this is a simple home page. And if you want to change the content, just open the index.php in your favorite editor. And after that, you can change the content there. This is the about project and it's about the project. If you want to change the about content, then you can also change into about.php. This is all music. All music, all albums which you have uploaded, means which admin has uploaded will be displayed here. Right, so you can see these are there are a lot of music albums here right and if you click on the album then you will be able to see all of the music which has been uploaded right and this is a play button once user click on the play button then he will be able to listen the music but there is a restriction without registration in the system without login inside the system user will not be able to listen the music right so I will show you later. This is a registration. If user doesn't have the user ID and password, then he will be able to register from here. And after registering, he will be able to log in and listen all of the music which is available on the website. This is a login. This is a central login for the admin as well as a customer or the user. And from here, once admin or customer login, the internal menu functionalities and internal operation will be changes. Will be changed. This is a contact us and this is the static contact us page. I'm not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database. Even I'm not sending any type of email and SMS from this page. Okay. So I'm going to log in. So the user ID is Amit and password is test for the customer, for the user, normal user. So this is the customer dashboard. Here he can change the password and see the tracks. So this is a change password. From here, he will be able to change his account password, right? So the second one is the tracks, all tracks. So the same page is opening, right? Now this one. Now, if you want to see and listen any music, just click on that. And this is the music detail page. And if you want to listen the music, then listen to music, then click on this. You can see the music is playing. And you can uh, uh, increase or decrease the sound here. The play timer is coming here right you can see download you can download the music so this is the full uh, flash player right from here uh, means user can listen to music listen to music right so okay so this is the this is only the functionality for the user means user can log in and he can listen to music log out so once log out then the above menu will be changed because it's a session driven now I am going to log in as an admin. So pass login user username is admin and password is test. Once we log inside the system, we can perform these operations, right? So let me go through one by one. So the these operations is also available here, right? So there are three modules here in the admin section. Add new track from here. Admin can add the track. Right? This is the album, and it will. Uh, contain all of the albums which you have added. If you want to add new album, just click on the add album. From here, you will be able to uh, add the albums with images and details, right? This is add new performer, means who is singing the song. It's the 
anyone, right? Like Ati, Ati Faslam or X Y Z, which performer is uh, 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 means singing the song? You can add all of the performer here. This is the report. All reports you can see here, right? You can see edit and delete. If you click on the edit, then you can edit and uh, edit the operations. If you want to delete it, just click on the delete, and that uh, track will be deleted. Even you can search from here. If you want to listen the music, then click on here, and the same page will open here. And after that, you can listen music here, right? Okay, this is the album report from here. All of the albums will be displayed, so you can see all of the albums are displaying here. If you want to edit it, just you can edit and delete it, right? And this is the performer report. All of the performers you can see there are three performers here: the Uday Chawan, Sonali Singh, and the Sri Alshal. Right? Even you can edit and update the details from here also, right? So these all operations I have developed inside this project music manager system. From here. Admin can add the album, performer, and tracks, and customer can log in and listen the music free. Of course, there is no charge for that. Right. So these all functionalities I have developed inside this project. If you need more functionality in this project, just put it into the comment. I will incorporate the changes. I will make this project more better and better according to your requirements. And don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest projects videos on the latest technologies. Thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much.